Okay, so what I've done here is I've got the XW1 wah, and we're going to compare it to some other wahs, some other popular wahs here. Now, the XW1 is modeled after the Holy Grail wah, the 1968 Vox, made in Italy. And this is a very uh, sought-after wah pedal. I mean, you see them going on eBay for close to $1,000. Uh, so we're going to compare it against the true Holy Grail wah. And uh, we've set up a uh, loop so that uh, this doesn't have true bypass, so it doesn't load down the signal. And then we've got a couple other, a few other wahs that we're going to compare it against. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a lick, and then uh, I'm going to work my way down, and uh, we'll uh, see how it sounds. <laughs> Wall number two. Wall number three. And here's the XW1. So as you can see, there's um, various different tones that you can get from these pedals. For my money, though, the XW1 gets a smooth, more refined uh, sound for the wah than the uh, than these other pedals, except for the uh, vintage Vox. The problem with the vintage Vox is you've got to pay a lot of money for it, and if you uh, put in any type of cir circuitry to make a true bypass, it ruins the value of the pedal. So for my money, the XW1 wah is the closest thing you can get to the, uh, the Holy Grail 68 Vox wah um, than these other uh, competitors.